layovers suck. There's really no way getting around it. It's almost always better to book a direct flight to the country you're actually trying to get to. But in some circumstances, layovers can be kind of enjoyable if it happens to land you in that in a layover country at the right time where you can go out and actually enjoy a bit of activity in that country. But other than that, layovers generally suck. So whenever I have a trip that requires a layover and there's just no way to get around it, what I would do is just fire, follow the airline's routing. Except instead of doing taking a layover flight, I would basically book two separate legs. I would book the leg to the layover country. I would enjoy spending a little bit of time in that country, maybe a day or two, and then I would book the leg, the quote unquote layover leg to the next country, and that allows me to basically get a little extra out of that same trip. Now. Sometimes the country that's being layover is not one you want to go to, so I would play with the routings that the airlines offer until I find one that lays me over in a country that I do I would enjoy traveling in. That being said, sometimes a long flight may have a direct flight, but I would purposely lay myself over. Like for example, Australia to the United States, Los Angeles to Melbourne is 16 hours. I would purposely lay myself over. In like Honolulu, and basically spend a little time under the sun makes the trip for a lot more enjoyable. Well, thank you for listening. Please help like and subscribe. Thank you.